We have Giselle Tarona, Deputy Managing Editor and Mobile Marketer. Hi, so basically I've written this whole story praising the Kindle Fire. Here's my Kindle. Um, I just got it uh, the day before yesterday. And basically, I'm absolutely just amazed by this device. First of all, um, it's got a dual core uh, processor, so it's super quick um, using Amazon's Quicksilver uh, web browser. So uh, the experience is definitely uh, superb in, in terms of you know how fast you can enter, um, access the internet and all that. There's a lot of choices in terms of apps, um, not as many as you would get you know in the App Store or in um, in the Android market directly. Um, but you know you can search for apps and uh, you know and, and use them on the device. Um, the only thing that kind of I, I don't really like too much I would say is the fact that there is no option to sort of uh, get like connected to 3G or 4G service so that you can have you know uh, access to the internet and other services even while you're not connected to Wi-Fi. Um, but this is definitely a not a communications device, it's more of a media consumption device. It's all about entertainment and I think that we're going to see a great uptake because it, the price point is really attractive and the fact that it's really small and I'll actually show you, here's my bag, right? I can just fit it right into my bag. So um, I think that, you know, it's consumers are definitely going to be using this device and I think that marketers need to start paying attention and uh, deciding what they want to do with the Kindle Fire in terms of uh, reaching potential customers and uh, existing ones.